video, we cover labeling a design profile. And how to do that, uh, we can click on, on, the, on the design profile. We can right click and go to edit labels. Another way of doing it is editing profile labels here. And we are presented with this uh, dialog box. And here, same as how we did it in the alignment, we can start adding uh, profile labels. Okay, for now, we will go with the crest curves. Let's start with the crest curves. And here we'll add uh, the crest only style, label style. And then for the sag curves, we'll also add that. Um, horizontal geometry points, lines. Yeah, we can also label the slopes in percentage grid. Um, Red bricks, we can add also that label. And once we are done with this, we can save label set as our RD1 label set. And we apply to our design profile. And there you go. As you can see here, we have the, the slopes of these uh, lines or tangents. And then for the curves, for the crest curves, we have the we have the crest the crest uh, annotation or labeling. And these acronyms, you can find them. Here at the settings tab, you can look for the abbreviations there and go learn more about these abbreviations. For example, let's look for BVSC. BVSC stands for Vertical Tangent Curve Intersection Station. Vertical Tangent and Curve Intersection. So this is, this is the start of a curve from a, a tangent. Basically, if you do not know what these abbreviations mean, you just go to the settings tab, you right click the name of the drawing, go to edit drawings and you go to the abbreviations tab and you'll know what the software is talking about. That's how to create labels for your